Hi, this is George with Wicked Warnings, here with a brand new Jeep Grand Cherokee. Got a nice blue and white package on it. Let me show you what we did. To start off with, we're using the six switch controller inside to control it, and one of the buttons called Pursuit does just this. This will override any other flash pattern going on on that light bar, but I thought it was kind of cool to give them a, a button that'll do a unique pattern all by itself without the rest of the warning involved. So uh, you can just hit this and have only this, or you could hit the regular front button and get full warning as shown now. So here we are with the standard front warning initiated. Well, what we have here is an interior light bar in blue and white with 180 degree optics made by Phoenix Industries. Behind the grill there we have the Wicked Warnings exclusive Thin X LIN series. That's in a blue and a white. We've got them set to alternate. We did a pursuit switch also on the light bar. I can show you when to push that again. Now, of course, the pattern is fully selectable for both modes. I just threw this in here as kind of a bonus. Uh, I do some unique things in builds uh, just to make them a little different. As you can see, right back to standard warning. I'm going to pan out and show you the side warning a little. Here's your off-access warning. Here in the back opera windows, activated by the rear switch, we also have a thin X in blue and white, set on a slightly different, more aggressive flip-flop pattern. Um, reason being is we don't have much on the side of this vehicle, so I wanted to make this light to be a little bit more faster and aggressive. There you can see we mounted one on each opera window in the back corners facing out. That's a blue and white LIN Thin X available at wickedwarnings.com. The front interior light bar is a custom order item, so uh, just send an email in to info info at wickedwarnings.com to get yourself one of those. I'll show you what we did around back. Out back, we put in a Phoenix Cannon two-color hideaway LED in blue and white in each reverse, as well as a Phoenix Fusion 600 with 40-degree optic, all blue, rear stick. The Phoenix items are special order, but uh, we can get them for you very quickly. Just give us an email or a call, and they'll be on our website very soon. Let me back up and show you the straight back warning. We've got the uh, reverse lights set to do a very similar flip-flop pattern with uh, to match the grill lights. I went a little slower on the cornering lighting on this vehicle on purpose uh, because he said he does a lot of road closures and things involved with public safety, emergency management. So uh, they don't necessarily need to have the most spastic pattern when you're just detouring a road. So the cornering on this vehicle is a little slowed down, a little bit more subdued, shows the colors a little longer, and lets you know that this is a white and blue vehicle and uh, does it without completely blinding you. As I said, the front and rear bars are also pattern selectable, so you can change whatever pattern you want for these bars, make it as aggressive as you want. The other benefit with this bar is I wanted to keep the warning at maximum, even if we were loading cargo uh, out of the back, so... As you can see, when the hatch goes up, the light bar remains. Uh, we hung the light bar from the inside, and we also used uh, a very minimally invasive method. Uh, you can see some pictures in the in the comments, or um, I might make the film, make this video have the pictures in it if I can get a... Uh, Wicked Warnings just needs a video guy, if you know anybody. By the way, uh, video editing, not my strong point. Back to the video. Here inside the cabin, uh, originally I had planned to possibly put the controller in this cubby area and hide it, but the uh, vehicle owner is not exactly sure what we're going to do with it. So we, we wrapped it and loomed it and just uh, ran it out the side temporarily here. We've got that six button controller. Here's our functions. The front light bar will do a flood mode, which I forgot to demonstrate, so I'll have to show you that again. And the, uh, you've got your pursuit switch. Uh, it also, this car has an air horn. <laughs> So we've got the uh, power air horn, we've got the front and rear switch, and a pattern selection. So uh, let me show you what that front flood mode looks like. Here you can see the front light bar will flood out white at will. It'll override a pattern, doesn't matter if the lights are flashing or not. And you can have a, a, uh, just a serious all-white flood bar in the front. Here inside the grill you can see our 100 watt PA electric air horn speaker. Again, controlled all from in the cabin here at the six switch panel. Give us a call, 630-361-4390. Check out our website, wickedwarnings.com. Email us in at info, I-N-F-O, at wickedwarnings.com, and we'll get you taken care of. Thanks again for watching.